Hello everyone, it's Emis Gideon here. I'm an author and a speaker. I'm the founder of GodwayBuzz.com where we help young graduates take care of their lives and start their own businesses so that they can contribute meaningfully to their families and society at large. Okay, today we're talking about offline business ideas for young graduates. Offline business ideas for young graduates. And the business ideas we have chosen in this series are looking at business ideas that require low capital so that uh, you have a low cost entry and then they allow you opportunity to grow, opportunities for growth in the business. So you can start from your house but eventually scale into a multinational. And the first business idea we'll be looking at is food processing. Food processing. And now people will always eat. And if you know Africa, we in fact we do not even produce enough food for ourselves. So we have to import, import food from different parts of the world. Now, because people always eat, this presents an, a, an enormous opportunity for you, an enormous opportunity for all of us. So whether it's uh, plantain chips, potato chips, you want to do, you're interested in, go into it. That's the first, and that's the first business idea I recommend, chips production. So it can be plantain chips, it can be potato chips, whatever chips you want to do, go into it, package it correctly, and have people sell these things. I know usually most people they have tend to have challenge when it comes to marketing their products. And when it comes to marketing, take your products to schools, churches, mocks, markets, where people congregate generally. Because anywhere there's mass congregation of people, there is money there. There's money to be made there. The next business idea I'll share with you is um, launch pack. Launch pack. Now Launch pack for corporate for corporate employees. These people, the society keeps getting busier and busier, and people can barely keep up. So many times, people wake up early without taking food or eating anything, and they rush up to work only to go find what to eat later. Some of these people are also busy on their decks that once they missed missed food, they missed it for the day. Your job will be to find restaurants and places where they cook good food. And then have a deal with them, negotiate a deal. Once you negotiate this deal, you now go on to where is it called now? The next phase, which is let people know what you do. Reach out to these corporate employees in their offices and get deals. Once you get a deal, supply lunch. You go back there and you get the lunch and supply them. So this is an idea that uh, if you have the time, it might uh, it, it, why it might not require you so much capital to start. It will require you. A lot of time, a handful of uh, it's a lot of time. So if you have the time, pursue it. Go out there, source for these food makers, and then those who are interested, and be the middleman that takes the food for the commission. The next one will be fresh juice production. Now, uh, okay, I like I particularly like fresh juice. I like watermelon juice, for example. And before I could uh, make it myself in my house. We, we we get just a small bottle, 75 CL there about, for about a thousand naira. So it's like, I have to go and learn how to make it. Why? Because I, I, I really liked it, right? Now, there are people who like this thing, and especially now that everybody's talking about healthy living, healthy lifestyle, people want to move away from the coca and the lights, basically, all right, to using natural natural food and freshly made fruit juice. So this is a massive opportunity for you as well. Dive into it, all right? Dive into it. Go out there, source for the materials, and do these things if you can by yourself. Okay, the next will now be financial services for underbanked areas. Financial services for underbanked areas. Now there's the agency banking platforms. There are uh, areas where banks are not penetrated. Now sign up as agents with some of these banks. Uh, I, I, know, I know there are some of them that their processes are quite tedious, but there are also others that are that relatively easy to enter. Find out these areas and then you can also offer services like account opening. I, I know someone who owns account, account opening for a thousand naira, and so you can t t figure that out yourself. Now account opening, deposit, withdrawals, and you get a commission on each of these services. Now it, the opportunity might look uh, like uh, not so exciting, but it's, the opportunity is massive because there are areas in this country that have not been banked. And if you look at closely enough around you, you find those areas. Now, the, tomorrow's video, that, that's it for today's video. If you have any question, 
drop a, uh, drop a comment or send me a direct message and I'll attend to it. But tomorrow's video, we'll be looking at the online business opportunities, online business ideas for young graduates. And now this is my own area of specialty, so uh, we might take a lot more time in that. Basically, but that's it for today, guys. Share this comment. If you have been enjoying these uh, videos, don't, don't do that by yourself. Share them. Drop a comment. Let me know. Invite other young graduates to come and join us on the series. Well, well, it's a movement, guys. We're out to empower the young graduates so that we don't have uh, so much unemployment and address unemployment in Africa. Be a part of it, guys. Thank you so much for watching today. God bless you.